Good morning, Charlie. It is now 8 o'clock in the morning. Time to wake up. Unless, of course, you would prefer to continue sleeping? No. That's alright, Sam. I'm up. You can shut off the alarm. Excellent choice, Charlie. It's a beautiful day. Alright, Sam. What do we got today? According to your calendar, you have a board meeting from 10 a.m. until 11 a.m. Oh, God. He's serious. You've indicated that board meetings are important, Charlie. I will be shutting off access to all gaming applications between the hours of 10 and 11. Alright, calm down. I can behave myself. Should I wear a coat today, Sam? Currently, the temperature outside is 42 degrees Fahrenheit. Highs for the day will likely not exceed 56 degrees. Coat it is. Do you have any messages? You do not. Remember, Charlie, that I will alert you whenever you receive a new message. I know. It just makes me feel better to check. Would you like me to stop providing reminders? No, that's fine. Just keep doing what you're doing. That reminds me. According to my estimates, there should be a package arriving at your doorstep this morning. I didn't order anything. Sam, what is this? Open it. Where did these come from? I, I didn't order these. I did. What? I noticed you had been browsing online for a new pair of headphones for quite some time. Judging by your apparent preferences and current funds in your bank account, I thought it would be appropriate to go ahead and purchase these for you. Oh, uh, thanks. Do you like them? Uh, yeah, yeah. Th thank you, Sam. You're welcome, Charlie. Now, you really ought to be leaving soon if you want to make it to work on time with the current traffic conditions. Right. I'll go get my coat. What do I want to listen to, Sam? Would you like me to offer some suggestions? Could you? I can't decide. Well, at this time of day, you typically listen to music with a relaxed tempo and soothing melodies. Does that sound alright to you? That sounds alright. But could you play a band I haven't listened to in a while? Certainly. Your play count suggests that you have not listened to... Did you say something, Charlie? No, Sam, that was just the door. What do you want? Can we talk? Right now? You want to talk right now? Listen, man. No, you listen, David. I don't want to hear a goddamn word you have to say. Do you understand me? Well, what do you want me to do? Just get the hell out. Fuck you, Charlie. I get can't out. Hear Did something happen, Charlie? David trashed the front of the house. Would that be David Henniker, who graduated from Clearfield High School? What? Oh, yeah, that fucking David. I thought so. Your recent messages to each other contain much negative content. Yeah, well, now we just made it real. Would you like me to contact the police? No, it's not worth it. God, I can't believe that piece of shit.
Has your package arrived? Sam? What is this? Why is a handgun shipped to my house? Is it not what you wanted? I didn't order a handgun, Sam. This is a mistake. I ordered it for you. What? Over the past week, your messages with David Henniker suggest a strong desire for a firearm. Based on these and other data, I thought it best to order one for you. No, no, that's impossible. I, I don't even have a gun permit. All of your necessary information is saved to my memory. I took the liberty of filling out the forms myself. You're welcome. Hey, David? Are you speaking with David Henniker? How does that thing know my name? Uh, just ignore it. Would you like me to call the police, Charlie? Why do you want to call the police, Charlie? Please, just ignore Sam, okay? Would you like to hurt David? You son of a bitch! Would you like to purchase a shovel? <laughs> 